Hey, for the Black Queen here, another episode of Green Axe, and today we are getting to Mentally Advanced Series Episode 10. We are in the double digits now. The double digits. Fucking hell! The double digits now. Um, yeah, so this is episode 10. I don't know what episode they are going off of. Um, yeah, so by Film Fan Philosophy, also known as Dawn Somewhere. And. Yeah, don't have any predictions, so we're gonna get right into it. 3, 2, 1. The following Dawn Somewhere, Elsie, okay. I am the greatest, I am the greatest, <laughs> ah, arrogant pony. I used to live in content misery, arrogant wow. pony. Until you just started <laughs> Already jerking great. with me. I like race cars, and I'm naked. Who's your friend? Faithful and strong. Wait, I'm not ready. My life's full of repeat defeats. Arrogant ponies, I hope you all show. Wow. Shut up! <laughs> and so that was fantastic. The heart of Equestria, our great leader burned the cities and abandoned them. Commanding the uh, winter, be descended. Call the cutie. Then, with their armies trapped in the cold, the god princess forged into their territory, burning their food, killing their families, and raping their land of provisions to feed her mighty armies. This act okay. not only cut off communications to the higher ups at home, but when the Griffin armies returned from the front, they found themselves without food or family. The effects of Celestia's strategy were so devastating, the Griffins are now an endangered species. Wow. The threat of extinction. I mean, yeah, we found out that it pretty much seemed like that. A lecture on our glorious god leader. Uh, no. Then what is that piece wow. of paper on the floor? I had to blow my nose. Go. Oh. <laughs> Use a tissue next time. Go oh. ahead then. Blow your nose so that we can move on with our next lesson. Um, I don't have to anymore. You startled the sneeze right out of me. Meep. Yeah. Meep. Mud pony. Meep, meep, what? What song? Shut, shut up, shut up, twist. Shut up. Look, twist, this has been a long time coming, and I need to tell you, you are the worst pony, and maybe the dumbest. I know we've had a great time over this past week, you know, since we started hanging out, but I just wow. can't overlook the fact that I honestly hate everything about you. I thought if I tried liking you, then you might turn out like broccoli and cheese, but it turns out you're worse than broccoli. So look, we just can't be friends anymore, even if that means I have no friends at all. Wow. Hey, looks like somebody got a visit from the Depression Clown. His wow. brightly colored pants keep falling down, and nobody ever laughs. What's the matter, kid? I just broke things off with my only friend, and now I have no friends. Oh, well, why'd you do that? My only friend was Twist. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Now I'm going to grow up to be just like Twilight Sparkle. Oh, Damn. I didn't worry about that. Twilight is just under a lot of stress because she's the queen's daughter. But deep down, I think she's pretty cool. She's the who's what now? I don't think, yep. I don't think that's the Crowns case. are pretty expensive, though. I think they keep them in museums most of the time, you know? Well, anyway, you and I probably shouldn't be left alone together, or I'm bound to get in trouble with someone. Why is that? It's wow. not that I don't like kids or anything. In fact, I think that maybe I like them a little too much. Also, I might be allergic to morphine. Should... Should I find a police officer? Like this yeah, one time I, I was know. supposed to be watching my cousin's you... kid, and her kid wanted to try eating ice cream for dinner. And you know, I thought I'd never really tried that before. Kids have good ideas sometimes. But okay. then I got all hyperactive, and I didn't so want just... to impress her, but then I crashed and broke both my wings and all four legs, and she started throwing up because she had too much ice cream. And when I woke up in the hospital, I wasn't allowed to watch my cousin's kids anymore. Your cousin's okay. daughter got to eat ice cream for dinner? That sounds fantastic. That's what you took away from that. Time. Well, I've just had a great idea. I've never had a grown-up friend before. Do you want to be my new friend? Yeah, are you kidding? That sounds awesome. This sounds familiar. Imagine demon blue, oh. I do. Keep up on your insurance bills. I forget what band this is. Turtles? Wow. She'll let you use the stove if you could know that she would be your sad demise and never prize. She hasn't got such watchful eyes. It makes me cry. She's not good with the children. I can't see. see. So when 
the first party goes to high, awesome the party. second party known as the Seeker begins counting to a number, preferably a multiple of 10. Hey kiddo, what's a multiple? Oh, multiple. Multiple. Oh, okay. Uh, oh my gosh, am I gonna have to do math? Oh, oh, oh. Pinky uh -oh. Knows again that you would enjoy. She can't do that, no. can she? Hey, Pinkie Pie. <laughs> you with my cupcakes. Cupcakes? Lady, you are speaking oh, no. my language. See you later, Rainbow Dash. I am ready for those cupcakes. Where are they at? First you have to make them, and then you have to eat them. Oh, well, baking cupcakes sounds <laughs> fun. The voice for this character is just... We are business like for, uh, pinky, we not to bake for fun, uh, but for purpose. Character is just gonna be for great. some pony? Did I just get roped into manual labor? Then you're gonna have to yeah. cupcakes. We are making contraband uh, cupcakes. Presents. What's contraband? We will smuggle the cupcakes across the border in our thummies. He just practiced for when Pinky goes to counter law. Then that is a secret, I trust you. I don't... What she come up trust? I don't think anyone Ooh, those they after will they try to assassinate in. Pinky. Pinky has enemies in high places. So y'all intend to sneak food into Canterlot by eating it before you go? No one will suspect. Okay, whatever I have to agree with to eat those cupcakes. <laughs> These taste terrible. Can I try making some with a cookbook? That is how they control you. Hey, you guys haven't wow. seen a tiny little creature running around, have you? I lost track of Taz. She's you right guys there. Probably keep an eye out for. Oh no, if you're looking for twists, uh, spinning their heads around or vomiting pea soup. I tell you to keep an eye out for weird behavior too, but in this town, <laughs> it seems like kind of a waste of time. Twilight yeah. Sparkle. I heard that you used your political influence to get named the prettiest pony in Ponyville. You're Applejack's kid, right? Why don't well, you use your political influence to help some pony? Well, why aren't Applejack's, you smart enough? Oh, to no, it's Applejack's sister. No, I just realized. To a child. <laughs> Well, I'm sure it would help yeah. if you weren't so damn childish all the time. It's important to look out for other ponies. Kid, one of these days you're probably going to go to college. Ta telling you're a child not to really be, soft not to be mating, childish. And it's going to be a total waste of everyone's time and money, but it's going to make you feel really important. Well, maybe I won't need the sciences. Maybe your science can't explain the reasons why I feel, and they can't explain all the big things, like what makes us angry, or in love, or full of hate about something. Your amygdala. My what? Your amygdala probably regulates the storage of emotional memories, which is why... What the heck mm. is an amygdala? Oh, well, it sounds Even like I've someone that knows less about science than science knows about her. Sure. Here's a uh, little tip, kid. You can never hope to defeat your enemies without knowing how they think. And by the time you know enough science to fight the scientific, it's already too late. You're already a scientist. Well, at least I have morals. Well, at least I wasn't born from consanguinous. <laughs> That's actually interesting. What's consanguinous? <laughs> Ooh, if you want to be smarter than science, one. you have to become What's a scientist. It, it, it's two to zero. You're winning your pretty little head right off. All right, let's go again. What you got? She does not have any friends. No friends? Well, I just can't get rid of mine. Another victory for Twilight. Pinky wow. Put it on the board. 2.5 to 0. Yes. You can't do a half point. But they are composed of half numbers. Well, at least I'm not a stupid jerk. Oh, my God. God, I'm turning into Celestia. <laughs> you made the wow. Cry. Look, kid. Yeah, you kind of I'm are. sure you'll do great in college or wherever it is that Earth ponies go. Just look out for Taz and tell me if you meet any pony that looks like he's been possessed. All your adult friends are plumb crazy. What's wrong with them? Adult friends are different, darling. I can drink with Twilight, get help with the weather from Rainbow Dash, and the others just sort of tag along. What about Pinkie Pie? No, I cannot explain Pinkie Pie. Well, I got no nothing can. to do for the rest of the day and nobody to play with. Well, I'm your friend, Sugar Q. You ain't nothing but my sister. Y'all better watch her or I'll turn that yellow hot tan. Y'all know how important family is to the apples. I want to marry who I want to marry. <laughs> At least y'all get the option not to marry. Unlike some of us, thanks to a certain cult cuddling stallion. What's cult cuddling? Never you mind. Look, if you're <laughs> bored, you can always come out and help sell some apples. I don't want to sell apples. I'll buy you some ice cream afterward. Let's sell some friggin' apples. Step hmm. right up, Phyllis and Gentlemen. Always the ice you cream. buy yourself some apples and you buy me some ice cream. Look at me, I'm just so mind-blowingly adorable. Don't you all want me to have some ice cream? Kind of. Now here's a fine lady bringing happiness to a child. Ass. Now I don't know the value of money, so I'm gonna assume that's about a million bits right there. Damn. Me, 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 me. Are you trying to stand between me and ice cream? Darn it, sis, you can't just force <laughs> apples on ponies like it were a marriage or something. You gotta try to be persuasive. Wow. With <laughs> okay, persuasive. I can do that. How would you like to buy me Hi, some ice cream? Sounds illegal. Are you sure you don't want to buy me That's any ice cream? Because I am the perfect height to reach your dangly bits. And I think we both know what I'm implying here. Look, I'm really busy right now and I'm doing something really important. I have to save a kitty named Mr. Fluffles from certain doom. Do not make me get persuasive with you. Stay back. 
I can travel through time. Well, good. You're gonna need that power because I'm about to kick your dick in the last Thursday. I will cry. Children have no empathy. I don't even care. You give me some friggin' ice cream. Okay, just take some money and leave me alone. <laughs> Jeez. Lady, I don't know if I should be disappointed or impressed with your behavior. One thing is for certain, though, you're fine. I'd be impressed, right. honestly. <laughs> Y'all can't just expose my nudity to the whole town. I'll call wow. child services. Yo, yeah, now you're naked. Friends can't grab each other. Clothes. You knew what this was. But, but I don't deserve grounding on account of being emotionally distraught because Twilight made fun of me today. She did what? Well, I am gonna strangle that Twilight, uh -oh. and you're grounded. But I'm confused because Rainbow Dash tried to teach me to fly from jumping off a cliff with a hang glider. Well, I am gonna strangle Rainbow Dash and Twilight, and you're grounded. Well, <laughs> Pinkie Pie. I am gonna strangle Pinky Dash Twilight, and you're grounded. But if I'm grounded, it's for the shy. And then I can't make no friends at all. All right, fine. You can go to the cute scenario, but then you're grounded twice to make up for it. I, I was just kidding. I don't want to go. Too late. Damn. So how'd y'all get roped into this year's shindig? Are y'all friends with Tiara or Spoon? Uh, my parents don't know where I am, baby. I travel here from the chamber of the From the dark places where only dreams may go. So you just wandered in? Do you like coloring? Uh, that depends. Are you offering to let me do a sketch of you? I have seen such forbidden colors. Well, that's good enough for me. You guys are better than Twist, at least. Let's get yeah. friends. My name's Apple Blue. Oh, uh, your name is really cute, baby. Mine's Scootaloo. I go by many names. CD belt, sweaty belt, treaty teeth. But you may call me Rackerzod. There we go. I am a typical I'm out of frame, Since sorry. We're all friends now, baby. Do you guys want to play a party game like Truth or Dare, Spin the Bottle, or Seven Minutes in Heaven? I think that we can all band together and kill Twilight Sparkle. Oh! Like gym, but have you ever considered just converting her over to our way of thinking? Yes. Perhaps we should convert her. Into a murdered pony. Every time one of us does it there correctly, we can -ah! get a piece of candy. Don't eat that, or you'll have to run laps across the border. So oh. tell Trackers on. That's a joke because she is a normal pony. What would normal ponies consume? I've got normal pony food at home. In my bedroom, baby. You guys want to go? Don't y'all live in the clouds, being a Pegasus and all? I thought you wanted to be friendly, baby. All I can be in your room is plumbing into my death. I don't want to plumb into my death. Do normal ponies do that? I don't want to do that unless that's what normal ponies do. Can we go to your bedroom? Yes, that's okay, what normal ponies do. Sure, I'll show you my doll. Do. I am blending in. Wow. Hey there, babies. Just thought you might want me to lay you down and play out a little bit of Scootaloo for you. We're gonna do Scootaloo in all the right <laughs> ways. So you just lay back and dig while I do it to you in your eardrums. Our first uh. place comes in is when I find myself in times of trouble. Mother Mary comes to me. This the Beatles. However, I like it, baby. Well, let me say it how I like. I don't think that's. I don't think that's the lyric. <laughs> to let it be. <laughs> oh. Uh. Miss Buzzy, I think. Something. I forget the name. I need to I've been driving all night, my hands wet on the wheel. There's a voice in my head that drives my heel. It's my baby Colin says I need you here. It's my oh okay I see. There's your audition for uh Okay. When she is lonely and the longing gets too much, she sends a cable coming in from the They were recasting rarity. Don't need no phone at all. We've got a thing that's called the radar love. Not that I care or anything. <laughs> We've got a wave in the air. I've dealt with the radar before. love. And that one goes out Tainted to love, you, Mother Mary I think. Moo Moo. I still love you, baby. Please come back to me. <laughs> also, I know U of P does a tainted, does a tainted love parody. Mary. Also, I don't even know if this is tainted Moo -moo. love. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. I, I'm ready for the next one. Alright, and in the next one, I'm terrified of snakes, and they're all Little over star and I got three Actually, and hold it, hold on. at the end of my sentence. I don't Can know if anyone has episode? ever been that afraid of snakes before, but I'll try. Oh my god. Sweet mother Mary Moo Moo, just hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on, I'm covering snakes. Oh I don't know god. whether to listen don't to this or read this. Just gonna make it angry. 
Okay, now just don't make any sudden movements. You go and you fetch the syringes food. until she I'll can prove she needs them. Try, try to keep them from biting the face. In, in times like this, it ain't cowardice to admit. Kind of foreshadowing a bit of sweet there, isn't it? Uh, uh, just, just hurry up. Go get that snake flu. <laughs> One just crawled That's on my loud. leg. Oh. <laughs> Help me! I don't want to die from snakes. So there you go, babies. I hope that tantalized your cutie little ears in all the right places. And remember, if you want my number, you just gotta ask. Call me, baby. Well, that was interesting. Again, that ending right there, I was kind of going back and forth between hearing what uh, Scooby was saying and then reading what was on here. But uh, it did mention the star in yellow, which I think is the last uh, Rainbow Dash Presents that I'm going to be reacting to, which I'll be reacting to after the next video I'm about to do. Though I don't know if I'm going to be doing that video tonight, my battery's pretty low. But, this was pretty fun. I think this might, this might be my favorite uh, Mentally Advanced episode so far. Um, I think I have some things to talk about, but uh, I don't remember. But it's like, yeah, the, the, the ending song, I don't remember what song, I, I'm, it's not Tainted Love. It's not Tainted Love. I don't think so. So, forget I said that. <laughs> That's not the song I was thinking of. Um, but I, just to bring that up, I do know that uh, UFP has a, has a, UFP sings Tainted Love, so I want to know what, what, uh, shorts I need to, be, I need to react to before where I am in UFP. Uh, I probably should talk about that next time I do UFP, but, um, if anyone can at least tell me what shorts there are up to that, um, that would help. But, for this... I really love that the parody of the uh, intro there. That was great, and uh, yeah, you had you introduced Twist and her weird speaking, and uh, I think Bon Bon and uh, Diamond Tiara had the same thing. Uh, it's almost like what a uh, it's almost like Scootaloo's scatting in UFP, but uh, it's not necessarily that. I guess I don't know. But uh, yeah, then you had that whole. Twilight and Apple Bloom scene. That was great. That was, uh, pretty funny. Also, uh, the Apple Bloom and the Applejack scene when they're selling apples in the, uh, in Ponyville. That was pretty fun. Then you have Doctor Who's come in there. And then, of course, you have, uh, Scootaloo and Thrackerzod coming in. So that was, that was fun to watch. Uh, I guess, because I'm thinking, I don't know if I should have been doing Mentally Advanced series before I did Rainbow Dash Presents. Because I know Rainbow Dash Presents came out after all of this, I think. But, uh, yeah. It's fine. I wasn't really too, uh, too upset about that. Um, but yeah. Overall, great episode. It was the longest one, I think, too, about 15 minutes. So, hope you enjoyed the commentary. God bless you. Stay safe, have a nice day. And as always, goodbye.